All right. Okay. Today, we are back with another Attack on Titan reaction video. And Jordan, we have made it to the season finale. We made it. I, I still truly don't understand how we are 25 <laughs> episodes into Attack on Titan. Crazy. We are literally more than a quarter of the way through this series. Are we going too fast? I don't think so. <laughs> it feels good. It feels good, but when it's over, that's not going to feel good. All right. Well, we can post the question. People, do you want us to slow down? Let us know in the comments down below. This is like a drug. <laughs> we will, it's like a drug. We will get to slow down a little bit. Yeah. Because we have some OVAs to check out after season one. That's true. Yeah. I'm not complaining. It's just like... It's a really, really good show, and we're not even through season one. Today we will be, though. The withdrawal that will come after this series is going to be crazy. Yeah. That is why we need to rely on all of you to help us fill that gap and feed our addiction. JJK, I'm seeing a lot of... It's got to be something. Demon Slayer? It's got to be something. Uh, there's a lot of them. Okay, that gives me a little hope. Yeah, yeah. That makes me feel better. All right, Jordan. Episode 25 of Attack on Titan. Uh, the rematch between Aaron and Annie has officially commenced. Um, this could go anywhere. Yeah. I mean, the predictable way for it to go would be for Aaron to hmm. win this fight and then... Whatever happens with Annie happens. Yeah. But literally 50-50, it could go the other way. If you were to bet a thousand dollars on this last episode, oh. right? <laughs> Who's going to win? Annie or Aaron? What would you bet? My money would be on Annie. I don't want it to be on Annie. Oh. Yeah. Wow. My money would be on Annie. Just because we already saw what she's capable of. Yeah. It seems like there's there's nobody who can hold her back. We yeah. saw the Titans devour her. We saw her transform using a ring. And we saw her get out of what Hanji was thinking was the trap that would allow her to devour all the information. Yeah. And it didn't happen. All right. I, I don't want to go with any. Where's your money going? I got Aaron. Okay. So how about this? We drop it down to a hundred. <laughs> okay, okay. And we actually make the bet. Hundred dollar bet. You got Annie. I got Aaron. Come on. I don't want to to bet on Annie though. That's like you just did. Shake my hand. Okay. How about this? Come on. Come on. No. Two hundred. You give me two hundred, and I give you a hundred. Because I'm I'm going with the bet that's like um. The bad choice. No. A hundred. A hundred. Shake my hand. Okay. You're officially a traitor <laughs> and you will be turned in. Let's go. You didn't see that ring on my finger? <laughs> you didn't Do see you take ring it back? on my finger? You don't have any rings that people can see your fingers. Take it back. I call my toes my fingers. Take it back or else. <laughs> <laughs> Could you imagine? Come on. Imagine that in real life. Yeah. That'd be crazy. Let's go. All right. And here we go, everybody. This is episode number 25. The season finale for season one of A.O. Here we go, everybody. Oh. Oh. Straight through his heart. Now he's got a goal. Yeah. Uh, and he doesn't even need to bite himself. Yeah.
Like, how did we get here? <laughs> how did we get Especially here? Especially in Sheena. How did we get here? That's the question, Jude. Come on. Come on. Skip it. <laughs> Skip it. We got to remember to watch until the very end, though. Yes. Let's yes. not forget. Yes. So they're in Stoa's district. The wall. Yeah. Okay. They got something coming for him. Yeah, you could feel it. You can hear it. He's gonna tear the roof off. Oh my goodness! Jared, they're all gone. Except for him. Now what? This guy. On. Imagine his perspective. Yeah. <laughs> it's like a bomb going off, yeah. though, Jerry. Yeah. That's what it is, man. Is she headed for the walls? Is she trying to destroy the walls? Right? Because she's running away from Aaron now. Yeah. Look at this. Unbelievable. はい。ただ、エレンは今まで一度も目型に勝てていません。いや。巨人になった以上、やつだって腹くっとるはずだ。そう簡単に戦いは気合で Oh, she's headed toward an open area. They can't use maneuver gear there. Ah. What are you saying? Split up. And work your way around to the other side. That's that a smart train? What was that? Oh my. <laughs> Oh. It's almost like she's testing him. Yeah. Like, I'll do it. Yeah. Annie, are you okay? <笑>アニ、お前はいつも周りがバカに見えて仕方ないって顔してたな。いつもつまんなそうにしてた。いや。そんなお前が生き生きしてる時がある。<笑> その格闘術を披露する時だ。そんなものに意味はないと言ってたけど。俺には。お前がそう思ってるようには見えなかった。お前は。嘘をつくのが下手なやつだと。This oh. is crazy. そう思っていた。なあ、兄。お前。何のために戦ってんだ? Yeah, that's the question. What do you think? She hardened her body again. Yeah. Damn, Aaron. Oh, he hurt her. Yeah. Those are military police members. Yeah. Oh, 
エルヴィン全て貴様の作戦がまないたことかそうだ<笑>テヨーン全て私の独断先行だ弁解するつもりはない That's courage yeah 街中でそんな作戦を決行すればどんな事態になるか分かっていたはず wow. なぜだなぜそんなことができた、wow. 人類の勝利のためだ。ふざけるな。Who is that? What do you say? To lead humanity to victory. Is that a kid? A little kid? It, why does that almost look like Annie? Yeah. Yeah. ふざけるな。貴様は反撃者だ。今すぐこの場で処刑しても上は文句を言わんだろう。構わない。<laughs> だが後の式も頼む。<laughs> Wow. Wow. This guy. Bad decision. Civilian rescue and evacuation. You gotta fight. Oh, I love Commander Irvin. Jared. Once again. Damn. Who was that? Marco? Let's go back real quick. Quick flashback. What happened? She's stuck. Is he biting her, Jer? Ah. Your dad is the only one on your side. That's her dad? Yeah, yeah. Oh no. Oh no. Alright, she left. Oh no. Yeah, he, he's gotta still be alive in there. Oh, he's definitely alive. Shoot. What the? Aaron, that's Aaron. That's Aaron. That's Aaron? Oh, snap. Ooh. Is that what they call a rear naked choke? <laughs> <laughs> Look, he just stopped her from busting the wall. Was she trying to go in deeper? I don't know. Ah, uh, good call, Annie. Uh, Hanji. Choke her out, Aaron. Yeah, yeah. Come on, Aaron. Come on, Aaron. He ain't got no arm, Jordan. And she's still. He ain't got no arm. Oh, take her eyes. Take her eyes, pop. <laughs> the 
Look how Jer calm Ervin looks. The most primal behavior you can get. Yeah. Oh. oh. All right. UFC ain't got nothing on this. <laughs> Destruction. The regeneration is crazy by both of them. She's yep. going for the wall. She's going to jump. She's getting tired, though. You can see it. Jordan, what is happening? One-legged Aaron. One-footed Annie. No, 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 no. She ain't going to get away. Mikasa. Oh, yes. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Didn't see that coming, did you, Annie? That looks about right. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Let her fall back down. <laughs> Oh, that is terrible. As she stare. Oh, are you okay? <laughs> she just said fall, Jared. Oh. What did he do? Inject her? You can make the whole world your enemy. Damn! I'll destroy you. Aaron said that? Yeah. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, there's oh. no stopping him, Jared. There's no stopping him. He's going to kill Annie. That you will return. Oh, maybe not, Jordan. Maybe Aaron's smarter. Look, he's going to grab her. She's crying. She doesn't want to be doing this. Remember when the female titan was crying, Jer? Yeah. Aaron's showing restraint right now. He's going to oh, no. kill her. Oh, He's... no, no. She's going to regenerate. Jordan. What's happening? They're fusing! Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, oh no. my gosh! Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. They got to cut him out. They got to cut him out. Right? Where's Levi when you need him? They got to cut him out. Is it? What just happened, Jared? Jared. Oh, no. Okay, okay. they got him. Where's Annie? Are we sure this is still Aaron? Right? Yeah. What the? Okay. Finale. <laughs> F season finale calls for a, a long one. <sighs> okay. Do you want to read this or, or talk real quick? What do you want to do? Um, whatever you want to do. We can talk for a second and then uh, attack right. this. Do you have any thoughts or notes? Your dad is the only one by your side. Yep. That's my main thought. Your dad is the only one by your side. Was he talking about himself in the third person? Are we sure that that was her dad? 75% sure. Yeah, that's what it, it made it appear, at least to us. Yeah, like similar to the Grisha situation. Yep. Right? Grisha and Annie's father appeared to be up to something. Yeah. Right? You think they're working together? I don't know. It feels like they both injected their children <laughs> with this serum. To turn into a titan. Yeah, he said something like, you can make the whole world your enemy. Yeah. And then I forget what he said after that. I was expecting an or. Right? You can make the whole world yeah. your enemy, or you can save humanity. Yeah. And it almost feels like Annie, she's been traumatized. Yeah. Like, she's not in control. Yeah. She doesn't want to be doing this. 
yeah. we saw her cry here and then just the titan tears yeah. that we saw a couple episodes back it, it makes a little more sense but we don't know what happened we don't know what happened and aaron asked annie the question what are you fighting for or he yeah. might have been thinking that yeah as super aaron titan and annie's father i believe said promise that you'll return oh something like that right same thing as grisha basically aaron promise you'll return to the basement or i i don't know yeah didn't it look like they were gonna fuse together though yeah what happened there no idea we don't we haven't seen any yet yeah we saw aaron he's outside so we think like yeah. you said yeah but there was this big object yeah it almost looked like a diamond or something yeah. right like when annie makes her skin hard yeah, yeah it yeah. almost looked like that surface yeah a little bit all right so we have a long what we can share so far it's all you here said the walls the year 784 one blistering hot night a miner decided to dig under wall sheena to live within the inner ring life in wall sheena would be pretty nice that thought had come to him suddenly a few days ago as he dug with his shovel deep in a coal mine in a way you could call it divine inspiration and so for the next few days he wandered along the wall finally settling on a spot where the dense forest pressed against it no one would chance upon him and the overhead leaves would shelter him and his task from the prying eyes of the guards above on the next night, he began. Using his trusty shovel, the miner began to dig. The work went smoothly, and before long, the pit was as deep as he was tall. When he could no longer fling the dirt outside it, he stuffed it into sacks, climbing a ladder to dis discard it. Completely dedicated to the task at hand, he took only a few short breaks to drink water and to ease his weary muscles. After spending 20 years of his life digging without a day's rest, the miner knew he was an expert at it. And during that time, he'd learned to dig deeper, more quickly and more efficiently than anyone else. The tunnels or tunnels that would stump any other miner were no match for his shovel. But that day was different. He dug for hours, yet never seemed to get anywhere. As he dug, he probed to either side of the main pit with his shovel, but it was of no use. The wall's foundation seemed to go down forever, deep into the earth, blocking his path at every turn. He still persevered. Any thought of digging his way to an easy life inside Wall Sheena had been long forgotten. He simply wanted to conquer the wall. I'm willing to bet all the years I've spent digging that I will beat this wall, he said to himself wiping the sweat from his brow. The hole was more than four or five times the miner's height when he struck hard rock. He wondered, bedrock? But it appeared to be of the same material as the wall's foundation itself. The miner swung his shovel down hard on the rock. The shovel dis shattered, but the rock was unscathed. The miner sighed and his sigh was deeper than any hole he dug in the previous 20 years. Okay, could this rock perhaps be the rock that we just saw? You're smarter than I am, um, and you're a better reader. Uh, you mind telling me what's going on here? Uh, I'm not quite sure, but it, it looks like we have a miner, right, who dug underground or who made it his mission to dig underground Yeah. in Walshina. Yeah, with the goal of living... Or dig under Walshina. Within the inner ring. Yeah. When you were reading this... I there was one part that said, like, the wall would, like, it goes so far deep yeah. into the Earth's core, right? Yeah. It says, the wall's foundation seemed to go down forever, deep into the Earth, blocking his path at every turn. Yeah. And I just got the image of an endless wall yeah. in the Earth's surface. Yeah. 
but then it's only what 60 50 meters high 50 meters high yeah what's that about yeah that's weird is this just a story like it says 784 are we talking about annie's father huh right what are we talking about here interesting right 20 because years straight this miner is trying to get into sheena annie's main objective was to get into sheena huh you know oh <laughs> see that's what i'm talking about man that i didn't even know what i was saying when i just I, said it there that makes sense right? dog if that's the case then that makes sense why annie's only objective was to join the military, military police. police if this is her dad yeah the flashbacks that we got make it think make me think that this has something to do with her father yeah all right all right let's see if there's another one yeah <laughs> all right you're up unless you want me to read no i can get it right, yeah. i'm just i want to make sure i understand what's going on here yeah. okay so it left off with him sighing deeper than any hole yeah. he'd ever done with a frown his friend questioned the wall it's weird isn't it the miner said lifting his drink to his lips who knew that the wall went so deep underground? Mm. The pair sat across from one another at a table in the back of a tavern in a seedy part of town. Most days, the miner would go there with his friend, his only friend after work. That day, the day after he would tried to dig under the wall, they'd gone there as usual once the workday was done. And then the miner told his friend the story, certain that his friend could keep it a secret. Mm. Maybe we're surrounded by walls not only above the ground, but below the ground too. Interesting, said the miner. Tell me something. What exactly are the walls? His friend cut him off with a cough, glancing around the tavern. The patrons were all busy drinking, hitting on the tavern maid, or yelling at one another. No one was watching them. But even so, the miner decided not to say another word about it. If anyone heard him, the military police would mm. be there in an instant. Mm. Does it really matter? His friend asked. Just keep on living here as you always have. You're poor, but you have a job every day and enough money that you can drink. Isn't that enough? Yeah, the miner replied. Yeah, it is. I'll go back to digging. In the end, I guess that's my lot in life. But the next day... <laughs> The miner didn't show up for work, nor the next, Ooh. nor the day after that. His friend went to his house many times, but never saw any sign of him. The miner had no relatives, nor other close friends, mm. so there was no one to ask where he might have gone. Unsure what to do, his friend eventually went to the garrison and told them the whole story. The next day, the military police wow. and the garrison organized a large-scale search party. It was a little excessive for one poor miner, even if that miner was a criminal who tried to pass under the walls. His friend couldn't understand why they were so bent on finding him, but they never found a trace of the miner, nor even the pit he dug. And one day, his friend also vanished, never to be seen again. Annie's father and Grisha. wild guess information we can share so far huh yeah, yeah. what <laughs> what this is just some random information they can yeah. share so sounds far. like a tell right right from a thousand years ago yeah but they don't really give any dates other than the the 784 so we have to assume that yeah. 784 20 years yeah what's that eight 14 804 eight. yeah 804 784 yeah 804 20 years you're saying 20 years that he's been digging yeah so it said the year 784 boom and it set up the the night yeah and then it sort of ended with the minor side and his side was deeper than any hole he dug in the previous 20 years so that would have been in 764 right oh okay uh -huh. so but still, the time frame is still on par, I believe. 
if I'm correct, yeah, I I had a hard time following it at certain points, yeah. brother. Yeah, because this is seven eighty four is shortly before the Titan appeared, right? Eight forty five. You're talking about that date? Yeah, yeah. And then a hundred years prior to that, yeah, seven forty five would be when the Titans first appear, right? Exactly. So I mean, if you do the math on that, right, eight forty five. Minus 784, mm -hmm. ballpark 60, yeah. right? 60 years of age that Annie's father would have been when Annie was how old? Between 10 and 20. Right. Right? That's not out of the realm of possibility. Yeah. Okay. Interesting. You saying Grisha and Annie's father. <laughs> Ooh. Yeah. I mean, they are in a similar circumstance, Annie yeah. and Aaron. Yeah. Their fathers pleading with them. And we saw so. how Grisha liked to travel, get around. Right? The flashbacks of him on that horse and carriage. Yeah. Where is he at, Jared? Yeah. One day his friend also vanished, never yeah. to be seen again. Yeah. I don't know. What if it was their parents? <laughs> Grisha and... And what's underground? What is underground? It seems like there might be an entire world down there. Yeah. He told, so he told the whole story to the garrison. Yeah. And the military police and the garrison organized a search party. And they could never find them. Yeah. Maybe because they transformed into titans and have been living outside of the walls. Exactly. What if there's like a, an entire civilization yeah. outside of the walls of Titans, humans who turned into Titans yeah. and they're just controlling everything? You know what we should do after we finish this entire series? We what? should go back and watch our own reactions. Oh. Right? Because I feel like at the end of this, we are going to be just completely shocked. Yeah. Let's go, Jor. All right, let's keep it pushing, everybody. Come on. We are a little more than halfway through. Let's finish this out. Where are we? I forgot where we were yeah. for a minute. That was so long. What so happened they before they fused? This? Oh, yes, right? that's right. And then okay. Aaron woke up. We don't know where Annie is. All right. Talk about a momentum <laughs> killer. No, that was good information. that noise Drew? yeah i don't know oh uh it's not ervin is it annie is inside of that oh so she's fully protected she's sleep oh wow No. Oh, they're going to carry it underground. Oh, they're not going to carry it underground. Oh, they're not going to carry ああ。だといいかな。エルヴィン、本作戦について 
なぜ憲兵団の協力を依頼しなかった区長それは女型の仲間が潜んでいる可能性がある以上潔白を証明できるもののみで行う必要があったからですだが俺によってストヘスクが受けた被害についてはどうお考えか我々の実力が至らなかったのです深く陳謝します謝って済む問題かてやヤツをこのままにしていれば壁は破壊され被害はこれだけは済まなかったはずです、wow. なるほどで多大な犠牲を払った今作戦において人類の終焉を阻止できたとの確証はあるのか今の人類の終焉を阻止できたとの確証はあるのか今の兄レオンハートから何か聞き出せるとは思えんがはい不可能じゃつまり無駄骨なのかうん、エレン体は大丈夫気持ち悪いくらいのことと言うな、うん、兄は固まったまま笑ってるのそこまでして情報を守ったんだ。ああ、まんまと逃げられた。逃がしたのはエレンだった。He didn't eat her. Yeah. そうでしょ、エレン。あの一瞬がなければ。ああ、アルミンの言う通りだ。うん。俺はやりそうだった。兄を見たら、いや、動けなくなる。はい。俺たちからか。じゃあ、また後で。ああ What's that about? Maybe he doubts Aaron. Sad, you're、yeah? oh, feather. Burr's life, man. We、yeah. keep seeing animals, all flowers.、Around. The sun, look at the just、yeah. the wind. Peace has been restored until a colossal titan appears over that thing again. Exactly. I feel like something bad is about to happen, Jir. Are they burying Annie? <laughs> Are they what? Bur burying her underground? Like they brought her underground, Hanji、oh, said. That's right. I don't know. But I'm going to be able to get the Jindu. I'm going to be able to get the Jindu. I'm going to be able to get the Jindu. I'm going to be able to get the Jindu. Yeah. Yeah. It's 
first time we're seeing someone eat. Yeah. A lot. Wow. Hold on, let me go back. These are all the characters, man. Yeah. Connie. Annie. Sasha. Sorry, I'm not reading this. One more time. I'm sorry. I'm going to sacrifice the time before humanity learned what it was that held them captive. There's the key. There it is. We have come so far. <laughs> oh my, Jared. Wow. I don't want this to end. I know, man. Oh no. Wait, Jared. Is it Colossal Titan time? Anytime you see the wall, that's what you think. Oh my! Okay, I thought. And here I was thinking that we weren't going to be left with any cliffhangers. Yeah. How has humanity just not completely been wiped out already? Right, this fight yeah. that people are putting up has just been nothing short of miraculous. Yeah. Right? Literally, like, I think w the image that captures it so far is of the the wood or whatever it was stuck in Aaron's body. Oh, man. Right, that moment right there. That's, that's how close humanity has come to the brink of elimination. <laughs> that right there. Mm-hmm. And it took Aaron to get up and bite himself to save everybody. And it took Armin to yeah. devise all of these crazy intelligent plans to save everybody. Yeah. And it took Mikasa to cut the fingers off of the female Titan to save everybody. And it took Ervin to devise it all. And he's not stopping. Just when you think one plan has failed, he's back with another one. Yes. I appreciate that we saw so much failure mm. because it'd be nice to see success all the time. It's just not reality. Yeah. You need to see, we need to see failure, death, unfortunately. Yeah. Are you kidding me? Yeah. In this episode, your death now just seems like it's just another day. Yeah the the congregation or what whatever that i don't know the word for it the church whatever they're dead all of them just easily i didn't see the the leader die yeah no the pastor whoever he was it was interesting that the writer kept him alive yeah oh, man it's gonna take a a few days i think to process this we'll go back and rewatch it I like to just think of like the things that we know and the things we still don't know because we learned a lot. Yeah. The past three episodes. 
So we now know who the female Titan is. Yeah. We now know how they had ODM gear. We think we may know what happened to Marco. Yeah. But maybe not completely. Um, we know that Aaron has this incredible ability to heal himself, his human body. And we just heard him talk about how he's healing very quickly. Yep, yep. And it looks like he's starting to gain control over his Titan self. It, it almost appears like he's teetering on the edge of ferocity. Yeah. If that makes any sense. Right? What do you mean by... It almost feels like Annie has tipped over to the dark side. Ah, uh, yeah. And Aaron, so far, has been on the good side. But he... I believe when he was on top of um, Annie, he said something like, I will... I will... What do you say? Did he say, I'll kill all the Titans or something? Something or... Something that gave made my alarm go off. Yeah. And that may be necessary to do what Aaron may be required to do, but yeah, it's going to push his limits. Yeah, man. Yeah. Do I owe you a hundred dollars? Yeah. Did either of them win? Oh, Aaron won. Aaron won. Okay. Aaron won. Annie is locked up in the basement of Sheena in a rock. That's one thing we don't know. Yeah. What is this? That Annie's covered around. She might be indestructible. You're right. She may live forever. Yeah, does she need to come out? Eat? Yeah. <laughs> Can she transform while in the rock? Yeah. Do they think that that's going to hold her? Yeah. Where they have her? There's a lot of things we still don't know. <laughs> What's going to happen now? But we'll get some answers. Wow. We'll get some answers soon. Season one of Attack on Titan. Wow. Done. This is fun. It lived up to the hype. This is fun, exhilarating, heart-wrenching, yep. real, traumatic, real, yeah. traumatic, real, yeah. and more traumatic. But I'm loving every minute, brother. Thank you all so much for watching the season finale of season number one with us. We appreciate your support more than you know. We hope that you decide to stay with us for the long run, especially if uh, you tell us that it only gets better from here. <laughs> We're going to strap in, prepare for season two. We have a few OVAs to watch. Yep. We're going to debrief, rewatch these episodes, debrief some more. Take a breath, take a sigh, a long, deep one. Yeah. And we'll be back. Leave a comment down below. No spoilers. We hope you enjoyed our reaction today, everybody. We love you. We love you. We love you. Do not forget. Be kind and keep an open mind, everybody. Peace.